Hey, superstars, it's your bestie, Scott, and welcome back to Marker Doodle Monday. Today, I am excited to draw someone who I've never had the pleasure of drawing before, and that's kind of surprising, but we're drawing Red Sox legend Carl Yastrzemski from my man, Dan. Dan reached out, and he was super excited about having this one done, and I was certainly excited about getting to do this for him. He gave me some reference photos to choose from, and I immediately fell in love with this particular shot of Yaz hanging out in the dugout, so I had to use that. Um, I don't really know how famous this photo is, but I like that it was different and just a nice little moment in time. You know, just a boy in his bat, not some intense crazy scene of Yaz smashing a ball out of the park or crashing into the green monster to catch a fly. Not that Yaz here was a boy, he was a man amongst men, a real baseball legend, uh, second only to maybe Ted Williams in the Annals of Red Sox lore. Uh, Yaz had 18 all-star appearances, 7 gold gloves, over 3,400 hits and 450 home runs, and a triple crown winner in 1967. And fortunately, he had a cool nickname because Carl just doesn't sound so tough. Anyway, I mentioned that Dan provided me with some reference, and that got me to thinking about doing a little FAQ on this video. Uh, sometimes people provide me with reference, and sometimes they prefer that I find something on my own that speaks to me, and I'm, I'm happy to work either way. I have gotten a couple requests for other sports, but for now, Marker Doodle Monday is strictly baseball. I, I do want to keep things focused, and uh, I do get requests to draw certain athletes. Um, how this typically works is someone will commission a piece like Dan commissioned Yaz, and then that person will buy the original art and have first dibs at the custom cards. I suppose I could start a list of suggested players if you want to suggest someone but weren't really prepared to buy an original, but obviously the commissions take precedence. Um, if you guys have any other questions, please let me know, but these are the things that have been popping up most often. Sales pitch time, you know the drill by now. I have made a limited number of custom cards with this art, and if you're interested, I have those for sale on my Etsy store right now, which I've conveniently linked in the description below. Once they're gone, they're gone though. That's a little advertising trick to make you kind of afraid that you might miss out, and then you'll rush over there and emphatically smash that buy button, and then my phone makes this little cash register sound, and then Mrs. Reindeer gives me a high five and I feel like I'm doing something right. Where was I? Oh, uh, yeah, uh, I should also mention that I did post a bunch of new shirts in the store as well, so uh, take a look at those if you stop by. And uh, as always, I appreciate all of your support. You guys rock. There's our man, Carl. I don't typically include that much background, but this one certainly called for it. So uh, thanks, Dan, for trusting me to do this one. And of course, thank you guys for watching. Now go find a better video to watch, and we'll see you real soon. <laughs>